150 Civil Air Patrol cadets visited Shaw Air Force Base for an orientation flight on a C-17. For many of them, it was their first ride on a military aircraft. But what made this trip extra special was the pilot, Captain Edward Sutton. He was also a Civil Air Patrol cadet before joining the Air Force. It's pretty cool. I mean, I can see myself, uh, you know, sitting on the plane 10 years ago doing this, and now it's cool come full circle. I'm, uh, you know, upstairs flying the plane, giving the tours and everything like that. Uh, so it really is cool to show kids, you know, what's out there and what their, uh, what their future can lead to. Cadets have the opportunity to meet airmen from many different specialties on base tours. Such orientations help them make important career decisions when they finish school. I knew I always wanted to do an Air Force career, uh, but I wasn't really sure what, you know, what route I was going to have taken. Uh, but if it wasn't for Civil Air Patrol, you know, I probably wouldn't have that direction to figure out, you know, what I wanted to do. The Civil Air Patrol definitely gave me the building blocks to be an Air Force officer. You know, probably the biggest thing there is discipline and what, like, what to expect, uh, learn the rank structure, and uh, basically know what the Air Force is all about. Meeting and flying with Captain Sutton gave the cadets a personalized look at where their Civil Air Patrol experience could lead them. That was huge motivation for me. I have a couple of friends of mine who have been in the Civil Air Patrol and are now in active duty military. And it's always neat just to hear their stories. It's just neat to see where they go after CAP, just the different opportunities that CAP opens up. That kind of influence, influences me to stay in as long as I can and go into the Air Force and have a career in aviation because I want to be a fighter pilot. Through shared experiences like this one, the Civil Air Patrol and the Air Force work together to inspire and train the next generation of airmen. Staff Sergeant Jenna Armstrong, Shaw Air Force Base, South Carolina.